Hey everyone, Jace from Alphatone Audio, and tonight I'm just doing the finishing touches on a customer build. He's got a nice setup here on a Schmidt Array pedal board. And one of the things that this customer really wanted was the ability to swap in new pedals very quickly and very easily. So he decided to go with the Gig Rig Remote Loopy 2, which is a great little device because he has an input and output on it. And he's got it plugged into loop 10 on his G2. And it just has two additional loops, which you just turn on using the control or the, the one of the foot switch jacks on the back and just enables you to just toggle whatever you have plugged in these two loops on very quickly and very easily. So one of the favorite thing, features about the Schmidt Array pedal boards is the patch bay on the side. Now, it's nice to have this amount of I.O. in case you just want to do like, you know, four cable method or you run a stereo rig or wet dry wet or something like that where you have lots of ins and outs. This particular customer just has guitar in and a guitar out, all mono, no problem. But that left four jacks, which is the perfect number for me to use with the loopy two. So basically what I did, uh, just set up these two, G2 in, G2 out, to go in and out of the looper, and I basically set up loop one, input and output here on the left, and then uh, loop two, input and output here on the center. And then from there, it's just uh, built him four individual patch cables and with labels on them. These are labeled just as they're labeled here, loop one in, like loop one in, whatever. And then over here, basically loop one, in and out, loop two, in and out. So then he can, oh, and in addition, I did a power splitter out of the power supply on the board, and this can just coil up and stay inside, and whenever he wants to try some pedals, he can just loop it out, run it up, you know, one of these side holes here, and then he has plenty of room to put whatever size pedal he wants to play around with. And then the, the audio is already done, because the remote loopy, as I said, is already plugged into channel, or loop 10 on the G2. So I just wanted to share this. I thought this was just a, a nice little trick that you can do with the patch bay here, assuming you have the jacks, and you just want a simple way that you can audition pedals on your board. So you can basically plug these in, take as much room as you need, and if you want to go to the gig, you can very easily just like unplug these, power cable rolls, rolls back up, you're not disturbing any of the pedals that you know you want to keep, it's just a nice, quick, easy solution. And the patch bay on the board makes it all possible. So hope this is helpful and I will see you next time.